Libra, hi, it's Lisa here from What's the Name Tarot. I'm here to do your weekly reading for the week of Monday the 19th to the 25th of June 2023. These are general readings only, so just take with you what resonates. Check your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, any number synchronicities that may occur, and cross watches are welcome. Libra. going to pause but I guess we'll take that one or not because there's two there already and I only need two and I've already got one <laughs> okay one more <laughs> Libra I say they're determined to come out in twos on top of it so the new moon and well, <laughs> I'm off to a good start. <laughs> Money halfway through the day. New moon eclipse. Expect powerful change. Well, there better be powerful change on my part because it's like you're not going to keep watching if I was like that all the way. Holy moly! New moon in Leo. Confidence is your key to success. Both around new moons here, okay, but confidence is your key to success and expect that powerful change that comes with it. Now I finally got those out. I'm glad they are can't um they've come out in that order there and together. Oh <laughs> I'm having a moment. Having one of those moments. Right, Libra. So let's begin. 19th to the 25th of June 2023. Clear messages from Spirit, please, for Libra. I'm going to go back in the pack, so we'll begin there. Overall, two of cups. Well, there is love here, whether you know it or not. Existing relationship, I always say, which case I hope you do know it. Maybe somebody extremely brand new, someone you've got your eye on. Confidence may be your key to success. Expect powerful change, possibly around love. Wow. Monday. This is the one that wouldn't go back in the pack. Look at the way to start the week. King of Pentacles. Success. Abundance. Getting control of finances. Everything seems to be falling into place. Expect that powerful change. It just may be right on your doorstep right there. Tuesday, Six of Cups. Okay, so this talks about the past, whether this is fond memories, whether it's not so fond memories, whether it's reconciliations of some sort, whether it's butterfly on your tummy feelings about what lies ahead after coming through some sort of tough past. But this is ultimately around dealing with something from the past either way so wednesday ace of cups new chapter new beginning so as i mentioned it may be a reconciliation having a new chapter it may be around love it may be a job you love it may be a home you love it may be an existing relationship it may be somebody brand new when it comes to love a lot of emotional energy throughout with the cups may be dealing with pisces cancer scorpio here but there is definitely some sort of new chapter that is getting underway here Love it. So into Thursday, Seven of Swords. Taking action here to walk away from some sort of deceptive energy that has been holding you back from getting this new chapter underway. Whether this is some gossip, some backstabbing, some um, jealousy that's involved here, this is about being able to pick up what works for you and to move forward and to leave everything else back there in the past. We just talked about the Six of Cups and to be able to focus on this new chapter that begins and continues forward from here. Friday, Nine of Pentacles. Success is right there for the taking. I always say, take it with both hands and run with it. But I feel like you've put a lot of hard work in to suddenly see that that success is starting to come your way. And it may be um, very quick, very sudden, but ultimately a successful outcome of some sort. Expect powerful change because it is at your fingertips. Love it. 
Friday, no, Saturday, <laughs> we're still on to it, Saturday, Four of Pentacles. Feeling like you're not able to break free or release from something or someone, it may be a legal contract you're tied to here, but this is about A, remaining very balanced while you're stuck in this energy, but also B, finding those leap, loopholes. And always say legally and morally, confidence is your key to success, and it's having that confidence to find other ways around things that allow that success to continue your way. And here, Libra, Sunday, Princess of Cups, an offer of love. You may be offering love to someone. They may be offering love to you. It may be a child. It may be a pet. It may be somebody significant here. But this offer is being made. A lot of love around this reading. And this is all around confidence is your key to success. Expect that powerful change. And this may be you actually stepping up to make an offer towards someone here. Wow. Okay, so Libra, let us clarify everything, starting with the Two of Cups, whether you know it yet or not. The Hanged Man, Three of Wands, the Emperors. I do feel like it's tied into this offer, and if it's you offering that love to someone or whoever's made the offer is now waiting for the other to make a decision here and as i said it still could be an existing relationship marriage proposal the next chapter and a decision is to be made this is about following your heart following your gut instinct seeing things very clearly and making a very clear decision here around this love wow i'm a pisces i love love and as you can tell, I love throwing things around as well. <laughs> so, King of Pentacles, Monday. Nine of Swords. Queen of Cups, Knight of Cups. This offer will not go away. Um, it's throughout. As I said, there is love throughout. I try not to um, stick to one kind of reading, but there is love through and through in this reading here. You're proud of how far you've come emotionally. This offer is confident the two of you do make a good team and work well together. It may be bringing a bit of um, sleepless nights, a bit of overthinking of things, and it may all be because of the waiting game to get that decision, but ultimately... That success is yours with the King of Pentacles around this offer of love. Wow. Six of Cups, Tuesday. Seven of Wands, Six of Wands, Princess of Wands. May have connection to another air sign, another Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here. The focus here is on your dreams and your goals and your wishes. And it's first I'm going to go there with A, it's not your past that is holding you back. This is about sticking to your guns, going after your dreams here, and claiming that victory. Others of you, this may be again, not someone not giving up on love, a previous relationship, reconciliation, and that may be your victory right there. But ultimately, around um, some sort of partnership, you're willing to share your ideas here with someone, and stick to your guns to claim your victory. Confidence is your key to success. Expect powerful change, and it's happening. Libra, Ace of Cups on Wednesday. Five of Cups, Four of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. You are working through some sort of emotional loss, grief, sadness, and I always say don't let others tell you to hurry up and get on with it. It's done in everybody's way. Take as much time as you need. Everybody needs to heal at some stage. Um, it's a big deal to say, I need some time, I need some space. And this is this whole hanged man energy to make a decision, to make a very clear decision. There is this new chapter that is about to begin and you're making sure that this is going to be what works best for you. And no matter how long it takes, if somebody truly wants to be there, they will be there. And this is about working through things at your pace, not somebody else telling you to hurry up. Wow. Seven of Swords, Thursday. Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Strength. 
may have connection to a Leo and I feel like you may have to do a bit of tough love here around this deceptive energy that you are walking away from I feel like you need to take action here to actually say look here this is how it is this is what you're trying to do and it's not gelling that well with me you know it's kind of speaking up letting your voice be heard here you've put a lot of hard work in you're proud of your achievements and how far you have come and it's taken strength to actually walk away from this deceptive energy but I feel like it is something or someone or somewhere even that has been holding you back and now you're taking action to I'm going to say deal with that so into Friday nine of Pentacles and now that success is right there seven of swords we've just come off that six of Pentacles the high priestess this deceptive energy it's caused you to put your guard up here and this is about letting this guard down even just a little bit here but making sure that whatever partnership is involved whether it is around love whether it's around work whether it's around home that things are balanced here, here internally here externally this is about equal give and take with some sort of partnership that is involved here not letting it all get one-sided Saturday four of Pentacles Libra the moon seven of pentacles double dose if I could pick it up <laughs> um, four of pentacles right there and it's talking about the hard work that is involved and in being able to release something or someone that you do feel stuck and bound to you may have gone through a separation previously there's children involved you have always got that tie to the other partner around the children but this moon is giving you a lot more clarity to see very clearly how to um, get through these loopholes how to get through some tough situations it doesn't come easily it does take hard work may have connection to a Pisces here but it's about remaining balanced as well um, with the synergy we just talked about balance before so the princess of cups to finish offer of love here justice look at that king of cups knight of wands you are in control of your emotions and you are determined to stay on board with this love um, we're, again whether it's an existing relationship whether it's somebody you've got your eye on or somebody brand new ultimately it's coming out with your sweet justice in your favor for the hard work you've put in that favorable outcome is coming your way you may have connection to another libra it is your own energy that confidence is your key to success expect powerful change and expect your sweet justice right there because i love that okay so Libra let's see what the universe says king of swords prince of swords ten of wands lifting this burden of feeling like you're on this journey on your own it's very clear throughout there is love here as we mentioned time and time again so problem shared problem halved working together here not rushing into things thinking things through clearly and logically and taking action using your head over your heart and being able to expect that powerful change and now to allow that powerful change to actually take place and it all comes back to that confidence is your key to success love that Libra okay so let's finish Star Temple Oracle You get number 35 the lapis lazuli star starlight my inner vision guides me to my higher purpose and that's your inner confidence right there it's your key to success key to your higher purpose and expect that powerful change with that love it so 35 star words insight perception passion the Lapi Lazuli star inspires personal and spiritual power. This energetic vortex reveals inner truth, encourages self-awareness, and promotes self-confident, intuitive expression. The Lapi Lazuli crystal is known to open the third eye chakra and balance the throat chakra. 
It stimulates psychic sight and enhances dream recall and interpretation. Wear or place lapis lazuli at the throat to amplify clairvoyance and visualization. In collaboration with the third eye, this crystal clarifies psychic and mediumship connection, thus increasing contact with the spirit realm for healing messages. Love, love, love that. So Libra, that is what I have for the week. Do hope it helped. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. See ya. Bye.